Hi friends, thank you so much for tuning in to the very last part of our Momiji Circus Full Box Friday. If you haven't seen the first two videos, I will definitely link them in the archive as well as the description below because I definitely got some really, really cute characters. But if you want to see who we get in this video, let's go ahead and get started. So I do have the very last four in the box, so we'll go ahead and get these ones out and then we will get to the unboxing. We'll go ahead and take a look at the box real quick before we open them. Here is the front, it just says Momiji Circus. It does have one of the figures you can get and the side of the packaging shows the other 11 designs as well as the secret here at the bottom. Then the rest of the box just gives you some more detail and the bottom lets you know that this packaging is recyclable. So let's go ahead and get started. If you've never seen these videos, these do come with a card that shows you exactly who you got in the box. If you don't want to know right away, just try to take out the figure without taking the card out as well. Oh my goodness, look at her. I am dying over this little peace sign. She's like, deuces. So I think she's supposed to be the actual circus tent. She does have this cute little flag that's actually kind of broken. I don't want to push it too much, but you can definitely see that it's coming apart, but it's definitely supposed to be like upright on her. So that kind of sucks. I'm going to have to be super careful with that, but I like her little off-white shoes. I don't know if they're dirty or supposed to be like that, but I really love it. I love her blonde hair and this interesting pigtail hair design thing going on. I love the glasses. If you watched the other video, I was raving about the glasses. I love figures, toys, anything with glasses. I just think it's 10 times cuter. Her little blush is in the form of stars and I am just digging her vibe. She doesn't come with an accessory, but that's totally fine. So we'll just go ahead and check out her card. And her name is Bessie. Very, very cute. And each one of them comes with their name and a story on the back. So hers reads, I like tap dancing and croissants. Oh, she's a girl after my own heart. And it also reads, celebrate the little things. They make life bigger and brighter. Like I said in my last video, these moments Momiji figures are so inspirational and I am loving it. Oh my god, I love this one. This was definitely one I was hoping to get. I love her. I love cotton candy. It's seriously one of my favorite things in the entire world. So this one is so cute. I love her four-tone hair. It's so very adorable. I love the yellow, even though it's not really pastel. It works really good. I'm loving this bunny cotton candy right here. And her old-timey restaurant outfit is so very adorable. So we'll go ahead and take a look at her card real quick. It looks like her name is Eva or Eva. And the back of her card says, I like caramels and vintage cars. Spread the sweetness, spread the love. I am just loving these little things right here. And I did want to mention, because I forgot on the very first video, but the bottom of each character has their little name and the Pop Mart and Momiji collaboration logo right there. Just in case you don't really keep these, you would still be able to know the name of the figure. All right, guys. So we're on to our very last boxes for the video. I really, really do want to get the secret, but I also do want to get the other two that are part of the collection. So let's see who we get. Oh my goodness, look at this one. I am in love. I love the color on her. She doesn't come with an accessory either, but that's okay. She has one right here. She is just a little elephant. If you know the Sanrio character's Sentimental Circus, she reminds me of that little elephant from there. I'll throw up a picture. And that elephant is one of my favorite Sentimental Circus characters. So I absolutely love this. The colors are beautiful. And I even like the hint of darker colors. It contrasts really well. I I am in love with this one. So we'll take a look at her card real quick. All right. And it looks like her name is Grace. That is so cute. And hers reads, I like oil painting and samba dancing. Don't worry if you feel a little wobbly. Everything's going to be fabulous. That is so stinking cute. I absolutely love her. All right, friends. So on to the very last one for the video and the very last one for the series. This one does feel quite heavy. So hopefully it's a good one. Thank you. 
All right. Okay, so this one's not the secret, but this is the last one to complete the regular collection. She is so cute. She looks like maybe a band member, but what even is this instrument? Like, no ma'am. I love her little hat and her red hair is absolutely gorgeous. This is a really nice one to end off the series. And I do like how the four figures we opened for this video, none of them came with an accessory. They were all holding it. So I think these were meant to be together. And we'll take a look at her card real quick. It looks like her name is Octavia. That's a beautiful name. And the back of her says, I like shiny shoes and salmon sandwiches. Every note we play creates a symphony of fun times. That is adorable. I am in love with this set, guys. I am seriously so in love with it. All right, friends so that's absolutely everyone for this video as well as everyone to complete my collection as i said if you didn't see the first two parts of this series i'll definitely link those in the i cards as well as the description but these are definitely amazing ones to end off the collection and the video series i definitely was really really hoping to get the secret one i'll throw it up on the screen because i think y'all need to see what it was i really wish i got her but i didn't but that's okay i absolutely love these for my first time ever opening momiji figures i knew i was gonna like them but guys I am blown away by the quality, the coloring, the material, the cards, absolutely everything. So I'm definitely excited to look into a second set and a lot of sets after that. So many of these I absolutely loved. I will say she's probably my least favorite for the video, but the other three were ones that I was definitely hoping to get. It's really between these two, but I'm definitely gonna have to go with this cotton candy girl. Her name's Eva, because not only does she have blue, but she has cotton candy, two of my favorite things. So she's definitely my favorite. But I did want to mention that I'm just now seeing how tiny this one is compared to all the other ones. And I think it's so darling. In the comments below, definitely let me know which one was your favorite. If you haven't seen the video where I talk about where I got these and how much I paid for them, definitely go check that out. That way you can leave a comment of which series you want to see opened up next because I show everything that I have in that video. Other than that, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up because it really does help out the channel. Also make sure to hit that subscribe button as well as turn on that notification bell that way you can be notified of the very next full box Friday because I have several coming y'all's way. Other than that I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I will definitely see you in the next one. Bye friends!